Hey everybody, it's John and I am going to give you another gear review today here on Active Self Protection Extra and today I have my very favorite, very favorite pair of hearing protection on and I wanted to share it with you. I'm getting ready right now. I'm about to go start packing for a trip to Alliance, Ohio tomorrow to participate in the Surefire Shoot House Bonanza and man, what a, what a cool thing that they asked me to come to. I don't know why I think I got them fooled. But uh, some incredible shooters there. Uh, a couple of friends from the industry, Bill Blower's going to be there, Tamara Keel's going to be there, David Merrill's going to be there, a couple of other uh, great riders, and they included me in that. So I'm packing my stuff and um, got my, my ear pro and all that stuff ready, and I thought, man, i got to introduce people to these in case you don't know. Uh, if you were talking about like electronic ears, 98% of what you're going to find in the world is either Howard Light import, uh, Impact Sports, which are fine, I don't have any problem with them, or uh, sometimes you'll find some Peltors, which are great as well, and, and you can get some good ones. But I gotta be honest with you, I, I okay, Mia Culpa here, first of all, I bought these full retail, okay? I paid the, for these on Amazon, had them delivered. Um, I've, not, I've not been given a pair of these. God, I wish, if you know anybody at this company that wants to do some ASP sponsoring, I'm in, okay? But I bought these full retail and they are bucks. They're a lot of money, okay? So I wanna just show them to you real quick as I take them off. I've got the little head strap on them, but you can see on the back there, they're actually back strapped here. And you can wear them without the head strap, no problem. And I love the fact that you can then put them on, put a hat on over them, you know, if you've got a helmet or that stuff, but I'm a, you know, I'm a lowly civvy, I don't do any of that junk. But uh, uh, just, I'm gonna pop them off and uh, turn them off and I can hear just as well with them on as off. And it's interesting because these provide incredible, incredible sound amplification, um, really, really solid. And more than that, uh, here's the thing about stuff like these. I took a flyer on a pair of MSA Swordens because I got a couple friends who are you know real operators who were like, hey, John, you want to check these out? And, and of course, if you go look, there's some folks, you know, if you look on these, then the NRR, the noise reduction rating on them is like 18, whereas you go to like a Howard Light Impact Sport, I think, or 21, um, stuff like that. But um, what you really want to check, I'm going to link a news story in the description about how the NRR works and how you got to be careful about how it, it shows things. Because these um, these are the Supreme X, these are the MSA Sword and Supreme X with the, the neck you know, band and the gel cups. The gel cups are important. These suckers are so comfortable to wear all day. Um, I find that the Howard lights, they, they end up pinching my head and my head starts hurting and I need to double up. Um, especially if anybody's shooting a rifle or indoors, I need to put on some, um, you know, some foamies underneath those guys or it's too loud. These guys here function fantastic on their own. And here's why. The NRR says 18, but that's across an entire spectrum. These particular guys here, they're, they're incredibly good in the spectrums that both a uh, pistol shot and especially a rifle shot in those frequency spectrums, it's more like an NRR in the 30 range. And so they're super fantastic at, at reducing the report of a firearm. So that makes them ideal for on the range and they also are tremendously phenomenal at sound amplification. And so, um, man, I, I can hear an ant scratching its behind when I'm wearing these things out on the range. So I can hear the instruction, hear the instructor really well, or if I'm the instructor, hear students really well, um, comfortable enough to wear all day on the range. And I'm, the only problem I've seen with them, and it's a problem with anything in Arizona, is when it's really hot out on the range, you know, they get a little bit schmutzy because of sweat. I haven't found a solution to that other than, you know, at breaks, pull them off, wipe them down, put them back on. But man, love these things. So I uh, can't say enough about them. The downside of these guys, they're about 260 bucks on Amazon now. And you go, oh, you, oh, and I totally agree with you. You can buy six pairs of Howard lights for these. You know, you can outfit a whole class for the pair of one of these. And if you're just going to go to the range every you know quarter or something spend a little bit of time you got an outdoor range you know you live in in flower country and you've got an outdoor range out in your backyard get a set of howard lights put some foamies underneath them it's just for you whatever but if you're on the range a lot if you are instructing or if you're taking classes on a regular basis if you're shooting every month every couple weeks like i try to 
man, this is really worth your time to invest in. I'll put a link in the description to an Amazon uh, link to them if you're interested in a pair. Those are always affiliate links and I appreciate you supporting the work we do at Active Self Protection by buying through those links. I think it's the best price I can find anyways. But even if you don't, that's totally cool. Think about a, a pair of Swordens as an incredibly good set of hearing protection and that is your gear tip for the day.